Morning team, hope you're uh, using your isolation time um, wisely. Obviously, this uh, video is being shot during uh, Corona lockdown. Um, hope you're sort of staying socially isol isolated. You can see out exercising, nobody around, nice and quiet. Um, so yeah, managing to keep my distance while keeping, uh, keeping a bit of motion going. But uh, as you know, we've got uh, two daughters on a very different um, sports scholarship journey. Our oldest daughter is currently at home on uh, summer break in isolation and studying online. She's in her second year at a college in Virginia. And our younger daughter's in her final year of high school and going through the recruitment process and contacting coaches and following up with coaches and meeting with coaches online and having those discussions. So today we're going to uh, go through with Amelia and start to build out a, a bit of a, uh, a table so that she can start to get a, a clear picture of the different colleges she's talking to and just how they compare with each other. So what I'll do is I'll uh, I'll publish that um, Excel spreadsheet later today when we've, um, or tomorrow, probably later today when we've finished it, and so that you guys uh, can get access to it. But what I'm going to do is just go back uh, to basics around, because now's the perfect time for, for you guys as, as parents and student athletes to be, you know, you've got a lot more time up your sleeve, uh, use that time constructively, start to do your research about um, what's on offer in the US college system, uh, particularly from a sports scholarship perspective. What does that mean to you? So get some clarity around that and whether it's going to be the right option for you. That's getting that clarity is the thing that's going to um, make up your mind uh, whether it's something that you really want and give you the motivation to go for it. So once, you've, once you start to get in motion, you start to take action, things will start to happen for you. That's the same. It doesn't matter whether it's school, whether it's career, whether it's your sports. You can apply this um, six-step process that we're taking you through to absolutely uh, anything. So once you know what it is that you've got clarity about what it is that you've you're going after it's very clear in your mind that's giving you the motivation to do what you want to do or do what you need to do it's then about creating a uh, a plan of action creating a sense of urgency okay and how you do that is by starting to put some timelines or some deadlines on yourself around the things that you need to do the action steps that you need to take and then actually doing the work so taking action all of this, this entire process basically helps you build um, your personal development, develop self-confidence and grow your skills, grow your capability. It's an amazing process. Ultimately, whether you go to the US or not, this process is really about giving you choices and options. At the end of the day, you'll make whatever decision is right for you. But if, having gone through the process, you're going to put yourself in a position to be offered a sports scholarship. And then if you do get offered a sports scholarship, then you have uh, the choice of whether you do or don't go. So it's, a, it's all about uh, choices. And if you don't, it's like anything in life, if you don't, uh, if you choose not to do something, not to chase something, then you're ultimately making a choice that it's uh, not going to be an option for you. And that doesn't matter whether it's your school grades, whether it's you know, representative goals that you've got in your sport. Um, you know, if, you don't, if you don't do the action, you're choosing not to uh, allow yourself to have that as an option. Okay, so uh, and this, this process is about uh, you creating a personal brand and putting yourself out there in a constructive way, particularly on social media. So we've spoken a lot in the past about needing to be um, very deliberate about managing your personal brand because it is your uh, single biggest asset. So 
yeah, so this afternoon, sitting down with Amelia to uh, create this, this matrix or table of uh, the colleges that she's talking to so that she can make a direct comparison across a whole range of different um, levels from sports to academics to uh, career rankings. So I'll just uh, hang here for a minute because the direction I'm walking in is a bit, uh, bit bright with that sun. So, so uh, yeah, what we'll do is keep an eye on the um, keep an eye on the comments. Keep an eye on the uh, any questions you've got. Throw them below, and we'll answer those in future videos. But I'll also put a uh, a link in the uh, description to uh, www.usain30days.com. So if you want more information on how you can put your, set yourself up for a great sports scholarship offer without having to pay thousands and thousands of dollars to a recruitment agent, then go to usain30days.com and um, click on the, uh, the website there, pop your email address in. We'll send you a whole bunch of uh, free resources and tools to help you get started. And then you know, if it's something that you uh, really want to go for and you want some, you know, some help with a step-by-step -step process to... Uh, get you there then uh, our uh, USA in 30 days course may be uh, of or may be useful to you okay so uh, our 30 day game plan will help you with a step-by-step -step process all the tools and resources and frameworks that you need to uh, to get yourself started and on the right track for a sports scholarship so stay safe team and uh, yeah we'll uh, get that uh, table out to you as soon as we've completed it cheers